It's a clear blue day outside the State Farm Building Technology Research Center in Illinois. <laughs> A storm is brewing. Your house versus severe weather. This is the area where you actually test wind damage and debris. Two by four right here that weighs eight pounds. Correct. Okay, going to be shot out of this gun. Okay, it's going to go at 34 miles per hour. First, we're going to shoot it at the non-resistant window. To show you just how powerful the impact is when the 2x4 is shot out of this cannon, we've installed a camera just to the side to give you a perfect view. Uh, the 2x4 would have traveled through the window, uh, through a couch if there was a couch there, and probably through the other wall, potentially going out the other side of the house. It would keep going out. We have an impact wall back here to stop the 2x4, but it could easily go through two or even three walls. So this is another good reason why when we're saying there's a tornado warning, take your safe shelter, don't come to the window and look outside. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, this time we're going to shoot a window that looks just like the other one, but it's impact resistant. <laughs> but this didn't go through the entire window. Right, and that's the key, is we've stopped that two by four that has the potential to go through two walls and a couch or whatnot. Uh, now you're less likely to have the wind pressurization that can actually start to rip a house apart. From windows to walls. A vinyl siding, we've got OSB underneath that. It's a two by four frame construction. There's insulation, there's drywall. It's very much like you're gonna find throughout the Midwest. Three, two, one. <laughs> Uh, even with a brick veneer, the 2x4 can break that, puncture it, and go right through because it's not a structural component of the home. Most of us, when we think of debris coming into our homes, we think of areas like windows. We don't think that walls aren't going to protect us, but this is a perfect example of how in your home you're really not safe in any kind of outside room. You need to get into that safe place. Exactly. During severe weather, it's safest to be on the lowest floor of your home. If that happens to be the first floor, reinforced walls in an interior room can better protect you from flying debris. Three, two, one. The 2 by 4 just bounces off this wall that acts as a system to keep you safe, starting with this, a thin layer of Kevlar.